Hello viewers, this particular game video is recommended for mature audience. Code Vein is labeled as unsuitable for all ages and carries a warning of frequent violence and mature themes. So yeah, the game's rated M, so if it's, if you can't watch M stuff, uh, I would click out, just to be safe. But if you are mature and you're watching, thanks for watching! <laughs> Viewer discretion is advised. Hello, this is Jolly Gaming Panda, and today we will be playing more Code Vein. Just a reminder, this game is rated M, has a lot of blood and violence, so if you're sensitive to that sort of thing, I would click out. Viewer, discretion is advised. I always make sure to remind my viewers this at the start of videos. Oh my, so many of these lost. Oh my, even the dogs have turned into lost. That's kind of sad and scary. Mostly it's just sad thinking the dogs who were in this city could have got turned into the lost. That's so sad. My, this city's dangerous. Why must I do this? This is terrifying. Oh, see what I mean? In the last video I was talking about how sometimes the lost will be resting. You might mistake them as a dead body when they're actually sleeping, and if you walk by them, they'll wake up and turn their weapon on you, so... Good to catch things like that, try be mindful of surroundings so you don't get ganged up on. Oh, what's this? A little wine? Are they all walking into preschool for the laws? <laughs> Are they off to school? Hmm, should I bother them? Oh, good idea, Lily. We'll attack from the tail. We'll sneak up on them. Huh? What? Wait, what's hap- What? Hey, I'm supposed to be doing the sneaking up on. We're getting sneaked up on before we could- This rate, we're not gonna be able to attack them. We were gonna attack from the tail. Come on! Oh no, they're so slow. How are we gonna catch up to them walking at this pace? Just, like that. Just keep going. Oh no, there's one waiting over there. No, they're all gonna know this for sure. <laughs> oh, yeah. Our cover's been blown. We should have just. Oh, oh no! Oh! Oh my! We gotta retreat, but I'm getting attacked at the same- Oh no. Oh. We lost all of our lost shards. We gained these lost shards from the lost when we defeat them. If you suffer even just one defeat, you lose all of it. So now I can't level up or nothing. I'm out of- Lost shards, haze, or whatever you want to call it. I'm all out of it. So, may need a new plan. that's no better than losing the experience you get from fighting bad guys. Uh, what's the point of going onward if I lost all of that? Hmm. Let's just go back to the entrance. Oh wait, I clicked the wrong one. This just took us right back over here. Um, I think I'm gonna want to go back to the beginning just to get some of those lost shards to regain what we lost in a way. We don't have any story mode cutscenes to get through now. So... We should breeze through it pretty quickly, plus we already... Th 
this is the first time in a long time I've tackled this game dogs. in years, but I'm already remembering just from playing a little bit where the bad guys are, where the lost are, how they battle. So I think we should breeze through this pretty quickly. Hey you! Come at me! I'm ready! I'm more than ready! Take me on! I'm not even gonna be slow and quiet anymore with approaching these things. I just want to breeze through this uh, very quickly. <laughs> Come on, very quickly. That way we could get back to moving forward <laughs> from where we left off. I just want to make sure to get regain some of that experience I lost from that defeat. Just. What would be the point of moving forward when I lost all day? Anything here? There you are! You won't get past me! Oh my. This is a very intense game, that's for sure. Wow, there's so many of them! <laughs> oh my. This is very intense. But Louie's helping us out. It's possible in this game to go, well, out on these exploration quests, fighting the loss all on your own. You don't have to have a partner with you. But I do think starting off in the game, it's very vital to have a partner accompanying you. But if you really, really want a challenge. I guess you could just not have a partner like Louie with you, but I would definitely recommend it. I seen them napping there. Can't get past me. I know all your tricks. We can't see around the vehicles. Take care. Uh, this is scary. There's so many vehicles. Louie was just like, be careful around the vehicles. Because if you get gained up on, you're pretty much cornered and in a tight spot, which is of course not good. Oh, there's the big one. I probably would have been better off sneaking up on her since this one's pretty strong. But I'm in a rush. Oh my. Bluey, I hope you have my back. Oh wow. That was quicker than last time. I guess after getting through certain parts of the game for the first time, it's a lot easier when you return to these areas and give it a go a second time, because you know what to expect. Okay, um... Let's go to home base. I really should just level up my equipment. I don't want to lose the shards again like I did last time. It would defeat the point of going back and doing all that all over again. So let's make sure to use those lost shards. You know, we definitely need to be using them. Alright, back to home base. After the loading finishes, the loading's taking quite a while. Okay, there we go. Home base. The safest place in the entire game. Because everywhere else in this game is just scary and very unsafe. It's just not safe anywhere else. Okay, I wanna upgrade stuff. Yes. Upgrade. My weapon. My sword. Oh good, I'm able to upgrade that. Great sword. Wow, I was able to upgrade it quite a bit. Which blood veil do you want to upgrade? Could I upgrade my... No, I can't upgrade the jacket. Okay, take care, then. But we were able to upgrade the weapon quite a bit, so that should be handy. While it is important to level up your character's level itself, 
I do think it's very important to level up your weapons and your e battle equipment. That's really important. Just as much as leveling up your character, I think. I think most of the time, back when I played this, I only leveled up my character, but now that I see that there's options to level up weapons and stuff, I do think it's more important to try and level up a little bit of everything. I didn't learn about it till I stopped playing the game for a while, checked out some videos and little things about Code Vein, and when I seen all that, I'm like, oh, I didn't know we could do that. I don't know if I ever did it. I might have not. I can't even remember. It's been a while since I last played, but I am surprised I've remembered quite a lot from it. Okay, let's go down this ladder. Let's start over what we were trying to do before. Let's just not screw up. Let's not get defeated this time. Because that would be really bad. Okay, let's go everyone. Oh my. These walls are nothing. Come at me. Oh my. Maybe not actually. Uh. Well, we didn't lose two- oh no. They're already hurting me quite a bit before I even get two anywhere. That's not good. As much as possible, you should try and not get hit at all if you can. Because as you explore, it gets more dangerous and tough battles. You need to save as much HP as you can so you could survive till you find another missile. And I'm so not falling for it again with th these little wasps just napping away. Like I know you're all just taking cat naps. I'm not falling for that again. You? Oh, this one's actually dead. Sometimes you could tell when they're laying around, if they have an injury or loss of blood, you could tell they're actually dead. Some of them, well, this one doesn't have blood and they're laying down, but they're... Huh. Yeah, it's hard to tell in this game. Sometimes you just have to have a gut feeling about some things. <laughs> oh no, my HP bar is already really bad. <laughs> Uh, this is a rough game. If you like challenges, this is probably a great game. <laughs> if you want to check it out. We shouldn't attack them all at once. Okay, I'm not gonna fall for this one again. The, they're right around the corner, and I'm not gonna get snuck up on again. Ooh, got item too. Material. Old world huh? material. Alright, come at me. I'll take you all on. Yeah, this is so much better. I was able to gang up on them this time instead of being the one ganging up on. Got him. Almost. Okay. Jeez, my characters keep getting hurt. How are we gonna survive this at this rate? My, there's so many of them. Oh gee, there's a lot of them. Oh no. Chloe, help! I'm getting hurt! And I need assistance! Oh no. Uh, I think I have to turn back. This is getting really bad. Oh my, they're chasing me! Wait, I'm not going back? This is a totally different area! Oh no, at this rate I'm not gonna survive. Now there's like invasion of the lost that's just all after me. Where's the ladder? Am I even going the right way? Wait, I'm not going the right way, am I? Oh no, I was going- oh no. <laughs> Gotta run! Louie, distract them. I'm trying to get away. Oh no. The dogs are gonna ruin it. 
They're really on my tail. Oh. We might not survive this. We might lose our shards again. Oh no. Yeah, we're not gonna make it, are we? No. Leave me alone, doggy. No. Wait. Are we actually getting away? Oh no, no, no. I... I no. Thankfully, Louie had one extra revive thing. That's good. Let's escape! Hurry! To the ladder! Before they could get us! Oh wow, that was way too close. That was way too close. Oh my. This game's intense. Let's go to home base to be safe. Honestly, we didn't need to go to home base. We were already safe, but since the music didn't really stop, I felt in danger, so yeah. We're returning to the home base. That was a close call. That, and I don't really want to lose my shards. If I could level up some more again, that would be good. That was a lot of those loss that we encountered. Alright, home base. The safest place in the game. Okay, could I upgrade anything? I almost lost all of my lost shards that I'm not trying to lose. Um, I can't upgrade any of these, actually. Okay. Maybe I could upgrade my level? Maybe? I hope. There we go. We were able to at least level up one level. That's good. Now we could just return. And try that again. We kind of got ambushed. I'm hoping we could get through this part, though. We will, but might just take a few attempts, perhaps. This game is challenging. It's not... It is kind of easy game, but at the same time, starting off, it's a lot of leveling up to do. So you're, you are going to get hit pretty hard when you first try out a new character and all that. Uh, I will be playing more Code Vein in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. I won't lose next time.